It has been fanfare all over as all the students of Mbogo High School Kawimpe reconvened. As an old student being here on this function, I'm very grateful because this uh, shows you that there's continuity. The purpose of this year's convention was to raise funds for the construction of the school's main gates. Special fundraising for the school main gate and we are proud of all those who have made great contribution to this cause. We promise that we are going to change the face of Mbogo High School. The event was graced by the former student and now director in charge of finance and administration at the Narium Secretariat, Hajat Medina Neham. We started here, we were taught discipline, we were taught how to, to become uh, men, uh, wonderful women of this world. We were told how to maneuver. We were told practical skills, life skills in this school. So I think coming back here, giving back to them is really a blessing to us. With many of these old students holding high positions of leadership and responsibility in the country, they are being regarded as an inspiration to the continuing learners. The National Treasurer of NRM, Nekesa Babra, was here. The National Chairperson of Uganda Muslim Supreme Council of Women, she started here and she was a head girl. Myself, the Director of Finance, I started in Bogo High School. We have so many uh, of, uh, of women and girls out there who have been mentored here. So today, coming here to support the children, support the girl child, give them words of inspiration, but also to give back to the school. Uh, people who have ex excelled in netball, who have ex excelled in uh, volleyball, who have excelled in indoor games. They are making money, they are making their living, and they are also changing the lives of others. Being us coming back here to give back to this school is to motivate uh, these students. Since 1995, the school has been among one of the top performing institutions in Uganda. We have produced women of substance in this country. Business women, politicians, educationists, medical personnel, engineers, and they have really uh, turned up in great numbers today and made very good contribution to the fundraising. Story compiled by Kenneth Tanava for UBC News.